thank you for tuning in to WBAM Student Television. I'm Riley. And I'm Georgia. And we will be your hosts for today's episode. Today is Wednesday, September 4th. And today is an A-Day. For lunch tomorrow, the cafeteria will be serving cheese and pepperoni pizza with sweet potato fries and fresh steamed broccoli or chocolate chip French toast and cheese omelets, hummus with pita chips, mandarin orange yogurt and granola parfaits, and a variety of other salads and fruits. You know, Riley, clubs and organizations play a huge role in Bailey's success. And on that note, we have a few announcements in regards to them this afternoon. First and foremost, auditions for the Bailey Singers will be held before and after school today, Thursday and Friday. Students interested in auditioning should grab an information packet from Mrs. Coldiron and sign up for a time slot on the course bulletin board located in the elective hallway. Next, YCI is a student-led Christian club that is open for anyone interested. They have snacks, after-school field trips, inspiring messages, and encouraging fellowship. Meetings begin on Tuesday at 8.15 and every Tuesday hereafter in room C1. You don't need to sign up. Just show up Tuesday mornings. Next, the sixth grade has kicked off their yearly service project. Running all year long, Bailey Middle will be collecting soda can tabs for the Ronald McDonald House Charlotte. Tabs can be collected at home or in school and turned into the box on the stage in the cafeteria or for teachers in the box located in the main office lounge. This is a great charity for a great cause, so collect the tabs from your drinks and bring them in. Next, WBAM Student Television is looking for some new cast members. We are looking for two new anchors, one weather slash sports correspondent, one sound engineer, and a board engineer. If you are interested in trying out, please sign up in the Media Center. Speaking of technical and behind the scenes ideas, the Bailey Drama Department is looking for students who are interested in working behind the scenes, building sets, making costumes, light and sound design, running crew, and stage management. Students interested can fill out an application for the Technical Theater Club. Applications can be found on the Drama Bulletin Board located in the elective hallway. Next, FBLA stands for Future Business Leaders of America. The club will meet next Tuesday through Thursday during Bronco Block. Over the course of the year, FBLA members will go to state and regional conferences, complete, compete regionally, conduct fundraisers for charities such as the March of Dimes, and participate in leadership activities and challenges like the Stock Market Challenge. Students interested must be enrolled in a CTE course, pay the $15 registration fee, which covers your t-shirt, and fill out the application forms. Forms can be found with Dr. Lester in the elective hallway. And finally, Attention all 7th and 8th grade students. Tryouts for fall sports is here. Fall sports include football, cheer, softball, volleyball, and golf. In order to try out, students must have filled out all their paperwork online and completed the health screening and turned it in to Mr. Real. Tryouts for football, cheer, softball, and volleyball began yesterday, while golf will begin next Monday, September 9th. So, bring your white t-shirt with your name on it and all other equipment you'll need, and good luck. Well, it sounds like we're off and rolling, and Bailey is doing the things that set us apart from the pretenders. It sure does. And as we get more club's information, we will get that out to you as soon as possible. Well, it looks like it will be another absolutely beautiful day today. I know. That's five in a row. For more on what's going outside, let's turn it over to Ashley, our very own WBAM weather girl. What's the weather like outside, Ashley? Thanks, guys. You're right about that, Georgia. It was another beautiful morning here in Cornelius. In fact, the weather report through Sunday will be clear, sunny, and very warm with temperatures averaging almost 90 every day. As you can see on the map, there is a high pressure system that has been working its way into the southeast. This will keep any effects of Hurricane Durian pushed off the coast of North Carolina. The only effects we should see here in the Charlotte metro area are a few clouds and barely 50 mile per hour winds on Thursday. It was a clear 70 degrees coming in today, with the high getting all the way up to 90. Physical activity should see the low to mid 80s today. So get out there and enjoy this gorgeous North Carolina day. That's it from weather. I'm Ashley signing off for WBAM Student Television. Now let's send it back to our anchors. Thanks, Ashley. You know, Georgia, we've had such a tradition of greatness here at Bailey with not only academics, but also athletics and the arts. But we've got to remember the greatness is a choice. We can always improve students and staff alike. And with that, I guess it's time to close out the show. Don't forget, every day is a great day at Bailey. And remember to begin with the end in mind this week. Define your mission and goals in life. Because you need to control your own destiny or someone else will. I'm Georgia, encouraging you to choose to be great. And I'm Riley, signing off for WBAM Student Television. Happy Hump Day, Broncos!